Welcome to How to Repair Your Own Legend Now. We appreciate your coming here and getting information from us. And we've just got a little bit of some bookkeeping kinds of things here to go over with you as we start. We're going to cover the four areas of this that, that we feel are really important. We call that assess, correct, make over, and monitor. Right. So we're going to cover those things. We would like you there on the webinar, you can type in questions to us. You can see that right there on your screen right now. Uh, we can't get to all these questions right here. We know that. I'll be monitoring over here as Dr. Mark is doing some other things over there. I'll be monitoring what these questions are and I'll jot down some of these questions and we'll answer some in those four areas. And every time we finish an area, we'll answer a couple questions, maybe one or two questions and then we'll right. move on. But rest assured, I mean, feel free to put in uh, your questions now because we will yes. answer all of your questions. It's just that the ones we can't get to during the webinar itself, we're going to send you back by email. Right, we'll email you. And if you send us a really awesome question, we may actually create a whole podcast about it uh, separately afterwards because we love to answer questions. So here comes a question. Francis is a life coach in Albuquerque. Okay. And she understood us in the correct, uh, but what's the number one thing she should do to start? And I think you just well, did, and we did a fair amount of this, but the number one, the number one to thing to start is, thinking, you know, to start her in her correct area. I, I got to go with video I in that department, too. again, because, you know, in our experience, it is getting indexed faster than anything. We put everything out in multimedia, essentially, so we are all about video, text, you know, video, print, and audio. I mean, right. we, we do them all, but that's why we can watch the results. The thing that zooms to the top of the indexing is video every time, Google in particular, appears to be really reserving about 30% of each page to put video content. Now, it doesn't mean that there's video on every one. In fact, you know, a lot of them don't, but that right. begins that no one's putting out video on those keywords. It's a good opportunity for you. And that's why it's such a big opportunity for you if you're finding uh, problematic information and there's not a lot of video, well, that's virgin territory for you to go and create a bunch of videos. You're, if you're putting out three videos on your keywords right off the bat, you're almost guaranteed to end up on page one fairly quickly because Google wants three videos on every page. Well, and the next thing that, that's important on that is, is that when people come to a page of results from Google and they see some videos on it, what do you think they click on first no matter what position it's that's in? That's right. It's much more visually appealing. We all are conditioned by watching television to, to passively take in information rather than having to work our eyeballs and actually read the words. So you're, you're visually, even if you're in the middle of the page and the negative information is at the top of the page, yeah, people are going to see it. But the thing is, video is more compelling. That's why it is important to get to that one camera, one take kind of thing more so as quickly as you can over the PowerPoint kind of things because people want to be able to look in your eyes. They want to see your sincerity. Uh, the best rebuttal you can give is looking right at the camera and saying, this is who I really am. You may have heard some things about me. Uh, you, you know, you see this during political campaigns. So, you know, there's a lot of negative stuff that gets put out there. And at times you have to look straight in that camera and say, look, this is who I am. You know, you can listen to what people are saying about me, but I'm going to show you who I am. You can look at my eyes. You can look at my body language. You can judge for yourself my sincerity. Uh, but that has a lot of power when you speak up for yourself in a positive way. And that just emphasizes again to all these negative political ads that we have and why. Well, why sure. can't they please just focus on a, a topic that's important to me and give me the positive? Well, the reason they don't is because the negative sells so well. Absolutely. The same thing here. So when someone's saying negative. Now, Fran Francis, right, it's Francis. We will get back to you and let you know a little bit more in our next section of what you might put in some of these videos. Hi, this is Charlie Seymour Jr. And this is Dr. Mark Osmond. And when you search your name online, what do you find? That's right. You, we always recommend that you go to Google, go to the search engine, search yourself, your keywords, do an assessment, look at what you find. Is that an accurate reflection of who you are and how you want to appear to people when they look for you? That's right, because we have Create Your Own Legend now, and we're helping people really build up that legend about themselves online so that when people search for them, they really see the side of them that they want. And it's 
three to ten pages deep of information about you that you control. But Charlie, but what happens when you do that assessment? You're in those first three pages and you find either it's not a good reflection of you or someone has posted negative reviews about you or negative information or inaccurate information. What are right. you supposed to do? People exactly. keep asking us that. People keep coming to us about that. So we're going to cover that in this webinar. I'm really thrilled with the outline that we've come up with for this webinar. So on Tuesday, we want you to join us on this webinar. See what it is to create that legend about yourself. Grow that personal side of you that other people can see. But when there's a problem, you need to be able to take care of that. And that's what we're going to be able to help you with on this webinar. That's right. So just click the link here. Go to the registration page. We're going to give you our four-part system for how you're going to repair going to your own legend. You. And you can choose on the registration form what time on Tuesday is going to work best for you. We're going to do this a couple of times on Tuesday. Right. So click that link. Go sign up for this webinar and learn how to create your own legend. And if there's a problem, how to repair your own legend now. Join us on the webinar.